Last week, the Lucas County Board of Commissioners approved a contract for the demolition of Ned Skeldon Stadium. This week, let's take a look back to 1997, where WTOL 11's Dick Barry gives us a look at the boys of summer getting ready for the new season. And here they are, your 1997 Toledo Mud Hens. Number 29 is here. Eight and 38 are teammates. And look at number 22. Boy, doesn't he look like he's in great shape. Maybe the Hens' new skipper can help us figure out who these nameless guys are. Well, I'm new too, so you want to help me with the lineup? <laughs> a couple of familiar faces are back from last year. But for the most part, these boys of summer are new kids on the block. Who's your favorite player out there? Number 11. What's his name? I don't know. Eleven. What's his name? I don't know. If I look out there and say, who's number 11? Can you give me his name? No, he just got his uniform today, so I don't know who he is. Here's a hint. He's 25 years old, from Albany, New York, and played last year for the Hens. Give up? Okay, number 11, who are you? I'm Glenn Barker. <laughs> what position do you play? Outfit. Third group is Casanova, Macarabitz. Uh, Adam sure. Rodriguez and Catatonalato. You really are going to need a program to tell the players apart this year. The Hens won't have names on their uniforms. Don't worry, though. It's not as confusing for them as it is for us. Yeah, well, but most of us were together either in Big League camp or in minor league camp, so we're pretty familiar with each other. Hens kick off the 97 season here at Skeldon Stadium Thursday night, 7 o'clock against the Ottawa Lynx. Don't forget to buy a program. Dick Berry, Toledo 11, the news channel. We're told work will likely begin here soon at the former home of the Mud Hens and finish by early 2023. For this week in Toledo history, I'm Diane Woodring.